keratoconus is a progressive degenerative disease of cornea. It results in thinning of the cornea and eventually protrusion of the cornea in a cone-shaped configuration. It results in myopia and irregular astigmatism. As a result of the irregular astigmatism, many of our patients cannot wear glasses or regular soft contact lenses. They end up using sometimes rigid or semi-rigid gas permeable lenses in order to have better visual acuity. What's important to know that keratoconus has many underlying factors behind that. One of them is the genetics. We do know that genetic has an important role. But environmental factors such as allergies, eye rubbing, bad contact lens fitting can also lead to keratoconus or deterioration of keratoconus. What's interesting is that keratoconus starts in our teenage life and progresses as rapidly over the second and the third decade of our life. When we reach our 40, it usually slows down dramatically. However, we still see sometimes patients in their fifth or sixth decade of life that have progression of their keratoconus. One of the treatments for keratoconus is a placement of semi-rigid or even gas permeable rigid contact lenses on their eyes. Some of our patients may even need to undergo placement of intacts. These are small rings that we place inside the cornea. And eventually they may need to undergo corneal transplantation.